engineer shot development. Yes, I know the rook is ugly on b8, but hey, it's not the worst. The knight on e8 is ugly. You say that we're down a pawn in a symmetrical position, right? But it's okay, don't worry. Oh, okay, we'll swindle for a draw. Oh, okay. I see. So, She's not being losing up a pawn is like nothing in chess. No, nothing. I mean, man, let's be honest. The worst is behind. The worst is behind. When that no. guy took that That's irrelevant the... a6 pawn instead of putting his knight into the uh, opponent's zone... Irrelevant, maybe. Maybe a bit too much. If, okay, he didn't go pawn. for... Look at this. No, he this went... Would have been, this would have ripped Alexander's soul apart. What are you talking about? I know, about? He, just went, he just went for the lazy way. I know, but he's still, like, good with the lazy way. Okay, Andrea's position is uh, getting better and better. Time to bring your king to c6. Come on, Andrea. All this journey with the king, you gotta keep going. King c7, king c6. Simple uh, king improvement. This is something she struggled with in the past. Like, she would find uh, the obvious king moves, but then, uh, okay, the moment where you can actually go aggressive with your king, like here. This is something she missed uh, in the past. She had a few good chances in some older games, but I think she's uh, probably gonna find it, because then what else to do? Like, you cannot make progress without your king. It's pretty obvious, because your pieces are tied down. But when your king comes, that is uh, making it obvious. Yeah, king c7, she's going for it, guys. She knows. We're just... We, we don't understand it all, but she already figured it out. He has 96 accuracy so far, 30 moves. Not too bad for a DJ. I mean, come on, she bring, she's bringing the king to the center. What, what kind of non-accuracy do you want to give her? Ah. Okay, rook b4, why can't we just go 